Made a bit of a mess. God damn it! So that's my lunch in here. So, back in the car again. Uh, been a bit of a weird day, haven't really done much. We just, uh, I made lunch, and then me and Matt have just been kind of chatting and sort of planning and organizing for the future, but, um, yeah. Maddie didn't really want to be in the video today. She wasn't feeling great, and she said she didn't look great, but. But I thought I could still make a video. You'd just be stuck with me for the whole day. Some of you may be thinking, just Alex, that's, that's even better. And you'd be right to think that, because we're going to have a really exciting time taking stuff to the dump. One more thing, I've got 20 minutes to get to the dump and to drop all the stuff off before it closes. So, why am I talking? Why aren't I driving? Hmm. Success. That was easy. Um, now the battery's flashing red light, even though a minute ago it said it had full battery. So I might have to continue this on my phone, maybe. Um, we'll see. I just need to go to like Poundland, get a few like little baskety things to keep all the food in the kitchen, like organising the cupboards and uh, a new uh, what's the word? Like a dish dish rail for like to dry the dishes when you're done washing them who knows how exciting this is but hey ho have you noticed how i end all my clips with oh almost forgot i've got all these packages to go back from that uh whole video we did a week or two ago and some other stuff too just realized i've been a complete boob the wiggle ones for collect plus every single other one is with royal mail now I have to go to a collect plus place, 30 second walk down the street. This is probably the worst thing that's ever happened to anyone. <sighs> so it's time for shop. That's all you're getting. state of his robes, Malfoy would say in a loud whisper as Professor Lupin passed. So, Maddie's actually asleep right now. Um, it's like nearly six o'clock, so I probably should start cooking, but of course we don't have any rice. The one time we don't have any rice because normally we buy it in huge bulk but since we've been up here in Surrey we haven't really bought any we've just been using what we have and yeah so I think it's either pesto pasta or I drive down to the shop to get some rice <sighs> okay I think I've decided to go get some rice quickly race against time to see if Maddie notices or wakes up I forgot to say earlier that um, the food I cooked Maddie at lunch was from a Bosch recipe. Um, if you don't know the Facebook page, it's like really pleasing, really easy vegan meals and puddings and things like that. Um, I'll put the link in the description. And they had a recipe for, sorry camera ran out of battery again. It was a sticky shiitake mushrooms. It was so good. I think because since we've been up here in Surrey, we've been having a few more sort of 
meals out of jars and stuff like that, sauces, um, just because they're there and available. And they're great in like emergencies when you've got no ingredients and you just need food quickly. But nothing compares to like a really nice, simple home cooked meal like that. It was, oh, it was so good. And yeah, go check them out because they have so many easy, really delicious recipes and it's all vegan, which is always a bonus. <laughs> Chuck everything in. Chickpeas, paste, ginger, tomatoes, everything. A few moments later. These things are weird. That's it for today. Uh, I think dinner is just about ready and I'm gonna dish up. Uh, me and Maddie have just finished our last tidying for the week, for the fortnight. Uh, she's off back down to Cornwall tomorrow, but we probably won't vlog that. She might vlog, she might, um, she'll probably be doing some stuff for her channel. In the coming days, it may already be up by the time I finally get this up. Um, sorry about the lighting in here, it's kind of, Spotlighting, never the best. One last thing, I've been having difficulty with this cordless vacuum I got at Christmas. It just kind of sucks everything up and then spits it back out again when you turn it off. <laughs> Taking it apart and cleaned it all, cleaned all the filters and stuff. But it wasn't that bad, so I don't know why it was, um, it just wasn't really working at all. Even when it was brand new, it just kind of seemed a bit weak. I don't know, does anyone else have this problem? I like gadgets and I like electronics. So I'm always interested to see like, I got that one because it was at a good price. I kind of got it for my parents for Christmas so they could like clean easier, do the stairs easier and stuff, but it just doesn't really seem to work. Maddie's mom has got like an incredible Dyson one. But that was like four times the price of this. So if anyone has any recommendations for a cordless vacuum cleaner, you let me know. But apart from that, I think that's all for today. All that leaves me with is to say good night and good luck. Also, let me know down below if this video is interesting at all. Just me on my own doing really exciting stuff. Let me know.